What's going on guys? Beastly Gamer here. Welcome to the channel. Today we're talking about PlayStation 4 and how well they're actually doing in sales. Now while I like to compare Xbox One and PS4 sales head to head, we all know that Microsoft does not disclose console sales numbers. Let's just hope that Xbox Live hours played have reached 1 billion hours because that's the only way that we can actually tally any type of information for Microsoft. But Sony has some really great news after the holiday season 2016. They had previously announced that they had sold 50 million PS4 consoles. Now, after the holidays, they've announced 53.4 million consoles after the holiday boost. I'll drop a link in the description. Sony PlayStation 4 sales rise to 53.4 million after the holiday boost. Sony sold 6.2 million units of its PS4 console during the holiday season, bringing the total global sales to 53.4 million units in the three years since it was launched, the company said on Thursday. The figure, calculated between November 20th and January 1st, marks an almost 9% rise from the 5.7 million units sold in roughly the same period of time a year ago. The last figures Sony gave were on December 7th, when it said it had exceeded 50 million PS4 sales. It's important to note that this was during the holiday period, so this figure included sales that had already happened. PlayStation 4 software sales during the 2016 holiday period reached more than 50.4 million copies globally through digital downloads of games or those sold in retail stores. Quote, we will aim to continue the momentum this year by broadening the PS4 title portfolio, further enriching the revolutionary gaming experiences on PlayStation VR and high quality gaming experiences on the PlayStation 4 Pro, while also expanding network services, said Andrew House, Global Chief Executive of Sony Interactive Entertainment. The PS4 console released in November of 2013 has become an increasingly important device for Sony as it struggles to grow in other areas such as smartphones. Gaming is one of its strongest businesses and the PS4 currently leads offerings from rivals Nintendo and Microsoft in terms of sales. Sony is keen to keep momentum strong with the PS4 and last year released a slimmed down version of the console as well as the PS4 Pro, a more powerful model. Sony also unveiled the PlayStation VR, a virtual reality headset that is compatible with the PS4. The Japanese electronics giant has not given any sales figures for the device, but Jim Ryan, president of Sony Interactive Entertainment Europe, told CNBC in October that it could sell quote, hundreds of thousands, end quote. But Sony will face heightening competition in the coming year with Nintendo's latest console, the Switch, coming out in March, and Microsoft's next Xbox slated to release later this year, the Scorpio. This is great news for Sony. Uh, 53 million consoles sold. The PS4 is undoubtedly going to be right up there, probably within the top three console sales of all time. They're doing very, very well. The PlayStation 4 Pro is doing really well, but this year is going to be the year to test Sony's grit. March is going to be really, really tough because everybody I know is getting a Nintendo Switch. I'm super excited about this thing. I can't believe I'm going to be able to play. I'm talking about the Switch on a Sony video. To be able to play games at home with my big 60 inch and take, take it to work and finish it up on my lunch break is going to be really, really awesome. So it's going to be tough. How will Sony adapt to the coming changes from its competition? Microsoft and Sony have some really heavy hitters coming their way with the Nintendo Switch and the Xbox Scorpio. It's going to be really tough and it's going to be an interesting year. And above all, it's going to be a great year for us because we're going to have some amazing games this year. Congratulations to Sony, 53.4 million PlayStation 4 sold through in just three years. That's incredible and they deserve a round of applause. I'd love to find out what Microsoft has sold. Can any of you guys find out for me? And you guys let me know if you think Sony will be able to keep up this momentum with the Nintendo Switch and the Xbox Scorpio coming later in the year. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give a thumbs up and show support for the channel. Join the Facebook group, follow me on Twitter, and you can support the channel at BeastlyGamer.com. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time. Take off.